Hi, Seth Rosenblatt here at Get Geeked SF, and I'm talking with Max from Vinci about smart headphones. Thanks, Seth. Glad to be here. So, basically, it's a smart headphone, but we designed the headphone to be more than just a music player. Uh -huh. So, I'm gonna give, maybe just give you a quick demo to show how it works. I think it's more than like 100 words. Sure. Before we jump into the demo, uh -huh. though, uh, just t t tell me what it can do. Sure. It's um. Basically, a stream music directly from Spotify. Uh -huh. It's designed to be more than a music player, so they play music locally and also play music directly streaming from Spotify, SoundCloud, and Amazon Prime Music. Uh -huh. And you can say anything you like. You can talk to it. You can say play Michael Jackson. You can say ask information. What's the temperature like for tomorrow in front of San Francisco? Or you can even call an Uber. Right. So wow. it's it's designed to be a more your like. A, AI enabled voice companion. Sure. For music, but also for everything else. What are they going to cost? It's going to launch in next month in uh -huh. US. So we're planning to launch in Kickstarter. Okay. Retail price will be one ninety nine, but on Kickstarter we will show up our appreciation and give our super early birds like ninety nine dollars. Wow. So it's like half off. All right. Well, why don't I take your mic sure, and uh, you can put those on and uh, explain how they work. Sure. So all you need to do when you want to listen to music is put it on. You see, the proximity sensor knows when you put it on, and music starts playing automatically. If you don't like it, skip to the next song, uh -huh. and up and down to adjust the volume. And if you want to listen to a very specific song, you can hold down and talk, play Michael Jackson, right. boom, it and starts playing. For people who can't see, he's been uh, just swiping on the side of the headset. Can, can you just show... Um, Without putting it on your head, here, take, sure. take your mic, sure. there we go. And just show how that works here so that so people can see. So it's touch enable. Uh -huh. um, you can just touch anywhere on the touch interface here. Uh -huh. Go up and down to the bottom. Great. So it's very simple to use. Wonderful. And it's going to receive over-the-air updates, I presume? Definitely, definitely. You, actually, that's a great one. Um, we're going to push the updates. Uh, basically, we highly customize the Android system on it. So uh -huh. it's like a mini computer inside. Right. Uh, we push the updates over the air, OTA, and uh, we, we have probably very regular software updates. Great, mm -hmm. great. Mm -hmm. um, and <laughs> does it have any storage? Can you keep any music on oh. it locally, or it's all cloud? Absolutely, absolutely. So we actually, you can, it, it's got like standard version got 16 gigabytes of local storage. Uh -huh. So you can save lots of songs. Sure. And um, so we're working with Spotify, a local deal that we're going to buffer. Uh, kind of like save a local buffer or go Spotify and so we, we are like go offline you can still enjoy the music sure. when it's go offline so basically play music from your local storage you can also just download all your music right in the headphone sure one of the things that, that I think is really neat about these uh -huh. is that they just they just stand up <laughs> yep. it's pretty cool it's a pretty nice design how do you charge them oh the standard version is gonna come in with a standard USB cable uh -huh. so USB can I use for power, but also for charging and sure. also for data. Sure. Great. All right. Well, Max, thank you very much. Oh, thank you, Seth. Glad to be here.